this door right here, it's red for a reason. But it's very expensive for us to turn your house into something like this. But it brings so much luck. Did you know that having a luxury car can improve your relationship? But come on, this is just way too expensive. Did you know that I have invested more than $10,000 on these crystals to attract wealth, but that is unreasonably expensive. Manifestation doesn't have to be that expensive. So I made for you the 2025 Abundance Ritual Energize Kit. These are the essentials that I use to get to where I'm at. You can have your dream house, your dream car, a loving relationship, and it's all in this kit. So visit my website, eTreatLove.me, if you want to change your life today and attract more wealth in the coming 2025. Raya tried to bring the holiday so early move over i'm already 2025 so if i'm gonna say it's time <laughs> it is time okay so <laughs> no because you know me of course i'm here for the wonderful future and what it it will bring to us right so so yes thank you very much to all the scorpios who has we're gonna do your oracle and then tarot and of course your astrology who has, of course, already made their order. Remember, always tell me your situation and your intention. This is the wealth attracting, wealth giving, magnet, everything. Okay. <laughs> so, um, um, I feel like people went crazy. So, the orders didn't stop, right? So, it's like, it just went crazy like that because of this. This is the you get this for this is free because I believe a talisman that is gifted is stronger than anything that is purchased. So I said, okay, then I'll give a money bowl charm. This is a bracelet right here for free. So when you get this, it's free. Um, of course, it's in the um, you know I create this energy to attract more wealth for you. Later, we're gonna discuss that as well. So we have a, we have a lot, a lot of time for this. Now we're gonna do your tarot. Um, I know Oracle and then your Tarot. I have the astrology here because I'm charging the chart. Okay, one on one reading with me for 2025. Meaning, if you want to plan out your 2025 and you want to have an appointment with me, there is some two spots I believe down there that is still open. Okay, um, those are temporary, meaning because I do this once a year when I do my personals. Okay, so let's see first. Okay. Oh, are we stalking? <laughs> Sal, don't say that. Like, you're, like, how can you out a girl, Sal? Y you should be on our side. <laughs> girl, I got you. You're not stalking. I mean, like, I mean, it's part of the day where you're just browsing. I'm just browsing, you know? But I feel like if you're browsing through their history, um, that's not just browsing. That's really like, yeah, I'm trying, uh, yeah, mind your own business, Sal. Mind your own business. Because <laughs> this is observing. <laughs> I'm just looking after them, so. <laughs> okay. I mean, we don't have to look at their LinkedIn, their Insta, their Snap, and <laughs> what? Friendster? MySpace? No, I just, because I couldn't, they don't have IG, so maybe they have a MySpace, and you know, I'm just trying to. <laughs> you dig deep. No, <laughs> you dig deep. You should, you should be working for a government agency. <laughs> okay. Um, for others, I see that the Scorpios are just waiting for opportunities and luck. There's a four-leaf clover here. This is not a shamrock, okay? This is more of, um, you know, this is here in the U.S. It's like, you know, it's like you want opportunity, okay? Relationship-wise, you are trying to make it work. You're trying to see it on their side. Um, you're making this decision objectively. You know, there's that, there's that, you know, I like it. I like it because... You're about balance, you know. It's like you're trying to work it while on behind the scenes. It's like, yeah, it's a different story there. So, okay, so there's the two sides to the coin over here. While you're hopeful, you want to catch them off guard. And like your intuition is telling you something about them. I don't know what that is. But so far, so good. Okay, so far. You haven't found anything much. Okay. All right, which now probably you're dying because <laughs> you couldn't find anything. Okay. So let's see your tarot. Saturn, ooh, TikTok, time to take action. Saturn is already direct by the 16, stationary, yes. Uh, um, it will be like, you know, coming back to its uh, motion. Um, and it's uh, in your fourth house. So a lot could be stressful or stress inside your home or like, 
um, exhausted to a point where there's just so many things going on at home, this is a time where it has been addressed and then now we move forward, okay? There will be focus um, on um, loans, money-wise, health-wise, there will be focus there. Um, a sense of relief is here, so it's a wonderful time. Dating-wise, is a different story because Rahu is still in the fifth house. Ooh, and then you got King of Cups right here. Okay, let me see. Mm. Mm. Okay. Your, you know, the King of Cups here shows you have a good head over your shoulders. Kings are smart, intellectual, driven, motivated. Um, you're uh, straight and honest. I like you, I like you, I don't, I don't like you. Don't even talk, you know. <laughs> it's a, don't waste my time. Um, there is a connection. Foreign person, could be foreign land. Um, inconsistent. Caught your attention. Oh. So this person, like out of nowhere, comes into your life, out of your life, does it bother you? No. You're actually quite observant uh -huh. about their actions. This one beauty, uh, beauty of uh, maturing is you. we become really more observed. Oh, maturing, Sal, we. Okay. Observe. <laughs> Scorpio observing is waiting to strike, though. It's a different story. But let's just say you're just observing them. You're observing them, how they are, studying them. Uh -huh. What they do, how they do things, how they react, and how they respond. Smart. Okay. Knight of Wands is free spirit, travels for a living, um, enthusiastic, exercise a lot. You know, this is sporty, sporty. When I say exercise, very sporty, young spirit. It could be young, okay? But definitely not your cup of tea, but then why not? Okay. So you took a sip. Mm-hmm. Okay. You took a sip. Are you attached? No. Not at all. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, okay. Mm. Ooh, here comes the mystery. Eight of Wands Justice card, you express yourself to them. Facts. I like you. Uh, you know, like, what is this? You know, like, you're straight. You don't shy away from that kind of conversation. You could have been a divorcee or divorcee. Justice is like, yeah, I had my thing in the past. That doesn't stop me from the future. But this person is still here, inconsistent, meaning whoever you're dealing with. But I talk to them straight. Like, listen, I'm not for this game. Not at all. Nine of Wands with the Two of Swords. You're guarded now. You don't trust them. So they have used all their cards at this point. They have pushed you to be um, in a... Like, the Nine of Wands, there are people who supported you in this decision. Yeah, you should block them. You know, it's like, yeah, don't talk to this person anymore. So they have pushed their luck. Two of Swords right here, um, you're questioning that. It's like, mm, maybe I shouldn't have, you know. It's a Nine of Wands and a Two of Swords with a Justice card. You're still trying to balance the situation. Got it. Person claims that they're busy, Three of Pentacles, and that you have hurt them, Queen of Cups. There's a reason why they're hiding themselves from you is because you have issues. Oh, they went for it, huh? Yeah. Like, you have issues. I don't have issues. You're the one who has a problem, not me. Yeah, you like that. <laughs> Dang, this person can see you eye to eye here. Like, they don't, they're not scared of you. Not at all. Probably that's the reason why you like them. Crazy meets crazy. <laughs> yeah, they're crazy. You like them crazy. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying. Uh, if you're a Scorpio who's going to say, oh, I don't want it, I'm healed. Oh, okay, go. Don't be this Scorpio. This is Scorpio here. <laughs> You're not the president of the Scorpio. You don't represent the the constituents of Scorpio, right? Okay. There's a Scorpio who like them crazy and spicy. You understand me? For food, we all have our own take. You know, some people like cake and sweet. Some people like it hot. This person is hot. <laughs> okay, so how hot? No, they're hot. Good looking. I don't want. So I say, oh, very sporty. Okay. Detached and cold, yes. And sensitive. Sensitive, Scorpio. You like them sensitive too. They're only sensitive because you went for it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so. So you bought your time. I see it here, Scorpio. 
Now, meaning like you're trying to stay busy. You have a side hustle here, Eight of Pentacles, Justice Card. Um, you're working on a project, legal matters is there, meaning it's like contract permits, all those things. So you could be moving, relocating because Justice Card is there. Um, you have been burning candles in both ends, working day and night. Like you're really like, I, I need to, I need the coins out, I need the coins. So nothing can stop you there with regards to the coins. So that focus is still there. Amazing. Sun goes to Scorpio. I don't have my watch, but um, on the 16th of November, officially, you will see in the skies, your 10th house lord will be in your first house. It is a Sankrati Scorpio. 45 minutes before the sun moves from one sign to the other is an auspicious time to manifest. Oh, yes. So today is actually one of the magical time, okay, that I will do it during the Sankrati. So this, okay, is everything in, like, in a sum, okay, of what I have been using for the past five years. You will see it at my home, but nobody's invited. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. So, but these are the essentials. When I say essentials, from six figure, seven figure, you have seen me in all my figures. Okay. <laughs> yes. So from, I know how it is to be broke and to be, I have, you know, you think I look good like this? No. 520. No, that's not dollar. That's my credit score. Not their doll, of course, right? Uh, I don't shy away. I'm an open book right here. So that's why I know how it is. And I know how magic works because I use magic, of course. Um, when I was broke, oh, nothing. You know, nobody helped me. Nobody. I use magic. I help myself. I help myself. Family was always loving. But can they get me out of my sickness, dying and this? No, not at all. Mm -hmm. So this is everything that has helped me magically at my home to bring where I'm at. I have enjoyed a lot of the good things in my life now. And that's why I share it with everyone. I'm not going to gatekeep. You want to be wealthy? I work with you. You want that abundance? I work with you. Tell me your situation and your intention. 2025 is the year, the time. You have uh, more time to buy a house, real estate, yes, business to succeed. And what else? Jupiter in the seventh, which means business partnership and any kind of relationship, okay, can be worked out. Okay, so this is the one that comes with the free lucky money ball charm. Okay, okay, it's not a question of oh, is it effective? All those things. It's a question of availability because you see it. This when I go and I share, oh, hundreds of people's. I'm out. I'm gone. I'm getting it. I'm getting it all. Right? So try to slow down though, oh, Scorpio. Um, yeah. So the, this is Goddess Lakshmi Isabel. I usually, I'm not usually. I I ring the bell twelve times at night. Okay, so I, after six. After 6 o'clock or by 6 o'clock, okay? That's a tea. I light my ghee, which is a candle. I'll give you a candle also, yes. Um, but it's everything. It comes with a complete guide, a video instruction on how to use it. I like this one where you keep um, you keep for uh, attracting more money in your wallet. This one, yes. And this one is for that luxury car I have shared with you guys as well. So if that's something that you are inclined with, harmony relationship, this one. And this one never broke anymore, that one, Okay. So free shipping in the U.S. We ship to more than 90 countries across the globe. I wouldn't be here, you know, with fame and success and all those things that people would want to label as what it is um, without me doing all this. Amazing. It's for the money corner at home as well. Okay. So, um, so use this time wisely. Okay. The sun is in the first house. Um, here it is. Um, Tenth house lord in the first means uh, fame and success and recognition. You can't hide yourself. I'm just saying, during this time, your person, okay, there's a six of cups in a hierophant. My, 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 Sharona. <laughs> I don't have my chart. Jupiter retrograde in the seventh until Feb. It's not for you to bring them back. They're coming back. Are they toxic? I don't know. I don't feel it yet. But they're crazy. <laughs> You, however, with the Eight of Pentacles, the Knight of Swords, Scorpio, I sense that you have this, I want to give them the last word, Knight of Swords. You're holding back, okay? I don't know if it's a sting that you're going to give to this person like that, like, oh, they're going to hear from me, Sal, you know, I don't, I don't see it yet, okay? But they have the Six of Cups, so the love, <laughs> 100%, you're cross-watching, yeah, you're in love with a Scorpio. I call a spade a spade. You want them. Woo!
empowered emperors emperor here so the scorpio while your lagna lord yes it is in its challenging state right now it's in the debilitation sign this is when you gain your power because you like to struggle not that you like it you thrive you become more successful <coughs> excuse me the more that you are pinned down like this nine of wands it's like a phoenix rising that's how you are mm -hmm. and the emperor right here is like oh i got this under control so mm -hmm. okay let, let's see uh let's see let's see <laughs> oh i'm not gonna stop there yet it just keeps getting better and better emperor and look at that empress i don't know why it's not focusing there you go divine feminine divine masculine and what is this a soulmate mm -hmm. and who has the hierophant them which is your seventh house relationship and partnership i just drew the emperor and empress so let's see here what is going to be the outcome of this relationship right because mm -hmm. this is now your twin your soulmate you know like a union oh wow <laughs> nice amazing okay now for people who wants to see okay oh what happens next in this connection i will continue with link below for the extended reading oh <laughs> scorpio find out more and don't forget to get your 2025 your kit while it's still available i'll see you in extended